Hello out there. This is DZ, your overlord, Desiran, and welcome back to Through the Woods. <laughs> uh, now we're going to continue on through the mire. I'm guessing. You tell them what happened. Well. Sake. If we tell them what I did, I'll lose the firm. They'll take Espen away. We have to. It's the right thing to do. Please, please don't say anything. It was an accident. I didn't mean it. I know. I know. It, it just feels wrong. Yes, but we'll get through it. Let's just get through it together. Okay? I love you. Please stop. Please. I didn't mean it. Don't show me anymore! What the hell? Lose the firm? What? What are you talking about? Want a what? A divorce, goddammit! I want a divorce! Here it is at last. Fine. You're welcome to one. But I'm taking Espen. You're not taking my son! Well, I'm not leaving him with you. You broke his arm, for Christ's sake. Why will you stop holding that over my fucking head? It was an accident. An accident! And you've looked at me every day since, like I'm some kind of monster. I'm telling you now, if you want a divorce, no. Espen is coming with me. You bitch! Please stop it! Here's how things went bad. She's lying! I never hit her or Espen! I swear, please! Silence. Sit down now. I find in favor of the plaintiff, Miss Dahl. She shall retain sole custody of her son, Espen Dahl. The defendant shall have no visitation rights, and a permanent restraining order comes into effect immediately. You, sir, are to have no contact with your ex-wife or Espen whatsoever, and must keep a minimum distance of 200 feet from them, their home, Espen's school, and her place of work. Court is adjourned. No, please, God damn it, let go of me, don't! Please, don't take him away from me. Don't take him away from me! Please. I'll stop. Eric can have him. I can't. I don't want to see what comes next. Please don't. Oh, no. So she lied in court about him being abusive. So that she wouldn't lose Espen. And if I'm betting, can we come in? You should sit down. There's no easy way to say this, so I'll just say it. Your husband was found dead in his apartment this yep. afternoon. Oh God! Oh no! Right now, we're working on the assumption of suicide that we were investigating. You're safe now. You and Espen are finally safe. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I wish I could take it back. It's the worst thing I've ever done. And I loved him. I did. I loved my son, too. I would have done anything to keep him close. I just had no idea his father would... That he... I made one terrible mistake and I ruined everything. I'll never forgive myself. Are you happy now, you bitch? Hmm. Well. Oh, we 
we got away from her. She decided just to torture us. Unless we're going to run into her now. The sun is starting to come up. I'm not going to make it. Uh, wait, in here? Aha. Uh -huh. Achievement unlocked hard depression. Oh, jeez. Well, damn, okay. Hmm. I have to admit, I didn't think it quite went that way. I don't know what to say concerning that because, like, I don't want to... Like, I don't want to go too far because I don't know... Like, obviously there's a lot of context that could change things, like, that could make things look differently. If you want to look at it in the basest way, then yeah, it could have been an accident, like, the whole thing from the beginning. And obviously that's a horrible thing to happen. But if he was holding it over her head constantly, I mean, that's that's not a good thing either. On the other hand, if he was then trying to just use that... If she was genuinely not happy anymore, although it sounds like she still loved him, but just their relationship was strained by that one moment. If... Uh, if she was genuinely unhappy and wanted a divorce, he shouldn't have... Like, it sounded like he was going to use that to purposely keep her from... Now, whether or not you want to say... Whoa. Whether or not you want to say he was justified in not wanting Espen to be with her because, you know, of the incident. Like, maybe he was genuinely worried that he would be hurt. On the other hand... Maybe he was overreacting. On the other hand, maybe he was just using that as an excuse to be able to take him for full custody. Like, again, like, there's any number of things you could say because we don't know their thoughts. We don't know their... who they were, what they were like, etc., etc. But, I mean, obviously this is all horrible. <laughs> Either way you look at it, that was horror. That's a horrible thing to have happen. Like, the worst circumstances, the worst events happening, and all from just one mistake. All from making one, doing one bad thing, or having one accident. I'm guessing this is it. Oh, hi. This might be the end. Ooh, what's that? The Sacrifice One, Eric's Tale. Eric descended and told the people what must be done, but they refused, shouted at him. They attacked him. No one would no one would give up their child. But amidst the turmoil, Eric's son stood and volunteered himself. Eric tried to deny him, but the boy insisted, and the people surged forwards, driving them up the hill. Eyes awash with tears, Eric took his son to the precipice, kissed him thrice upon the mouth, and cast him into the wolf's scaping jaws. Well, son of a bitch. So the f first sacrifice was his own son. Because none of the villagers wanted to give up their children. And can you blame them for not wanting to give up their children? I mean, you can't. At the same time, if everyone's going to die, what do you do? There 
there's no like this is these are those situations there's a lot of situations in this where there's no good answer things are just happening whether you like it or not this more than likely is not going to end in some situation where we can save the day holy jeez The Sacrifice to Eric's Tale The rumbling ceased, and there was finally peace. The war was ended. Eric fell to his knees and keened in anguish, but the people finally saw the truth. They would have to give their sons and daughters, one every five years, if they were to survive. So ended Eric's Tale. Five years. Every five years. Here. I guess it broke them. It, re it broke the village, so to speak. They couldn't take it. They couldn't do it. And Eric had to take to taking them rather than having them given up. Because unfortunately... Unfortunately, when it comes to deals with the, when you're dealing with gods, there's not too much you can do. That's where I came from. Holy jeez. Okay, run. going. Whoa. Espen. Okay. Go, 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 go. See a rib cage. For what I don't know. Oh, is this it? Is this the spot? <gasps> Utheim. Where? Where from here? Ah. Wait. No? Oh. We go higher. Holy jeez. Okay. Holy Christ. Oh my god. The wolf is real. Uh-huh. Well, I don't see it. Unless you're talking about that. The size of a mountain? Oh, I have to go through here. Okay. Holy jeez. This is nuts. This is just downright crazy. Um... Um, oh, wait, do I have to go up here? No, oh, wait, no, I'm an idiot. Go, 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 go. Oh, hi. Hello. Oh, man, oh, man, I think we're actually nearing the end. Across here? Maybe. 
baby. Oh. The hell? Okay. Ah, okay. Go. Oh. Oh my god. Okay. Okay, that's a little... Holy crap. Um, where do I go? Over here, I guess. What? Where do I... Game. Don't screw with me. Where the hell do I go? No jump. So you better have a way for me to climb up. Oh, here we go. Found it. Okay. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Go, 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 go. What? Was it? I heard that. Marker? Where was it? Oh, there. Okay. Why marker here, though? Oh. Oh. different oh well Eric went in too okay um um I mean what what <laughs> uh Will Fenrir spit him out? <laughs> uh, I doubt it. Son of a bitch. Ooh. Oh. Oh, all three of us fell. Espen. Espen. What? We're back. Wait, 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 wait. We're back at the pier. Espen, Espen, please don't leave me. Oh. No. Espen. Espen, come back. Do it, do it, do it, do it. Keep it, keep it, keep it, keep it going. Whoa. Come on, Espen. Come on. Mm. Mm. Please, please, please. Mm. Three, four. No. Please. Oh Go no. Back. Please. Two, three, 
Oh, die. Nice. As long as there's an X, I'm not giving up. Oh my god. Oh no. No. No, 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 no. Except. How long? Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Really? Oh, I don't even have an option to try anymore. Oh. One more shot. <laughs> uh. You have to actually accept it. God damn it. Espen. I'm sorry. I love you. I love you, little man. Goodbye. Be safe. In town halls and libraries, in hairdressers and bars, are people who will never know what Espen did for them. What he did for all of us. The world moves on as it always has, arrogantly, without a care, but it comes with a price. I couldn't save my marriage, and I couldn't save Espen, but he saved us. He protected all of us for a time. What? He was a little boy, my beautiful son. And I had to kiss him goodbye. I feel like my heart will never mend. He was better than me in every way I can think of. Wait, why are we back here? I don't know where he wanders or where he's going all alone. But wherever he is, I'm just... I'm so proud of him. I loved him so much, I ached. I love him still. Um. Espen was my favorite thing, my best friend, and I lost him. We lost each other, and I don't know if I can forgive myself, but now I can forgive Espen. I'm not going to pretend I was a good mother, but I raised a good son. Now all I have to do is make sure his sacrifice meant something. What? Achievement unlocked job accepted. Achievement unlocked through the woods and back again. What? It, oh, whoops. Okay, no, there it goes. I accidentally paused it. Oh, no, I screwed up the music. God damn. The game started as a scroll project in 2014, and without the dedication of these people, there wouldn't be a game today. Meyer prototype. Or, yeah. Damn it! Sorry for screwing up the music. Making it all possible. Tree Hugger, Kim Daniel Arthur. Holy crap. This. That's insane. That's. So she's going to take on his work. She's going to be the one taking kids? Who are willing to sacrifice themselves? Oh my god. Or is it along the lines of since your son actually sacrificed himself and did this, like you said, you don't want to be... Um, you don't want to be meaningless, you don't want to be without meaning, without worth... So you're going to keep it going, no matter what. Otherwise, he would have died in vain. Oh, man. That is... That's heavy. That's nuts. I, <laughs> I gotta admit, I was not expecting it to end like that. But, I mean, damn. Okay, this lack of music is freaking me out a little bit. <laughs> is there a way to... 
Lars Dwayne the Rock Johnson Pierce. <laughs> Holy jeez, so many people, so many backers. I mean, damn. This was an experience. It was a hell of an experience. I'm not quite sure... I'm not 100% sure what I'm going to follow this with. Um... I mean, obviously, obviously it'll be horror after this, I would say. Um, mm, but what? I've got a few games I could play. There's a few I want to play. There's a few in the in the backlog. So we'll see uh, what comes up. Maybe, huh, maybe something a little different. We shall see. Uh, trying to think if there's anything older I want to try. There is one game I've never gotten the chance to play yet. I may consider it, but we'll see. There, I've got a few ideas. Thanks for playing through the woods. I'm not gonna say I found everything. I definitely did not. I didn't probably didn't even come close to finding everything. But damn, that was a hell of an experience. Do I press anything? Hmm? Oh, no. Oh, there it goes. Okay. Anything after the credits? Damn it, I can't believe I ruined the music. Oh, I hate that. That was good music, damn it. Oh, there we go. Alright. Well, if you enjoyed this video, if you enjoyed this series, please leave a like, a comment, subscribe if you want to see more, and share it with anyone else you think might enjoy it. If you want to suggest a game, leave it in the comments below. And check out links in the description for Through the Woods on Steam if you want to try it for yourself. God damn, this is loud. And hang on, hang on, hang on. Please. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> and well, until next time, until the next game, this is DZ, your overlord, Desiree. You all have a great day. And I'll see ya. <laughs> ah!